It's Bob and Tom Tonight, starring Chick McGee, Christy Lee, Josh Arnold, Ace Cosby, Pat Godwin, Willie Griswold, and Tom Griswold. Welcome back to the Bob and Tom Show. Got something very special, nice little surprise for you. Oh, I like surprises. Matter, coming up in a matter of moments. I'm totally lying. I, I look surprises. A- <laughs> You'll what the hell happened? What's wrong with you? Uh, that's Christy Lee whining about this. Oh, this is going to be a fun little thing that you're going to really like. All right. Uh, she's uh, <laughs> at her post, her base, the Navy Federal Credit Union news desk. There's Josh. There's uh, there's Chick over there. I there's, really uh, missed you. There, there's Ace. Willie G's there. This we is Tom. You. Uh, Patty G is uh, once again in the Oxford Gold performance yes. room. And we're organizing our surprise for you right okay. now. While we do that, mm-hmm. uh, I will uh, urge. Well, it's uh, it's just sort of a surprise guest. I, I well, last time I did this, you guys lost your mind. It was oh, oh yes, guy that My got favorite. the famous bowling. <laughs> this is uh, there we go. We got love it. We, we got it organized. Love the hat. <laughs> dig it. Dig is that it. a fedora? Is that? Look oh, at this. Oh. Got a press. It's got a press fedora. On. It's uh, it's Jeff Oske. <laughs> Uh, oh, hope he's got the packing go. tape. Yeah. He's going to yeah. go ahead and go. take that hey. press badge. There you go. A brand new. Uh, <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, geez. That, oh, that's in your hair. <laughs> Great little bit of visual. Well, kind of a His Girl Friday uh, yes. costume. Yes. There we go. Uh, he's got the press pass in the hat, and he's uh, covering <laughs> news that. Um, Are well, you chewing gum? I'm just nervous, Christy. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, now, um, uh, you d- explain once again the name of your program. Well, uh, you guys, uh, you do a lot of news uh, during the uh, week, but uh, Tom doesn't always uh, share the whole story with everybody. I see. <laughs> so uh, what I'm here to do, I'm here to uh, give you the news that you guys failed to mention. Okay. What you failed to mention news, <laughs> Jeff Oskin. This hat's bothering me. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Side gags are great, so you have to live with this. Yeah, yeah. Especially on radio. Yeah, yeah especially on radio, yeah. Did All you, right. Did you hear that hat? Chicago has released 1,000 yep. feral cats to combat their city's rat problem. What you all failed to mention, those cats better be packing some serious heat. <laughs> Ew, rough town. Yes. 50 years ago, had Chicago had a rat problem, they would have called down to Miami and sent up Jimmy the Hammers and Dooley to take care of it. <laughs> Capiche? Yeah, I got you. I got you. And Dooley. Capiche? <laughs> Last week, a woman was arrested for beating another woman with a 10-pound beef log at a grocery store in Ohio. <laughs> what you all failed to mention, in Ohio, that's what's known as a certified USDA grade A ass whooping. <laughs> Do it in the Midwest. A beef log. Yeah. <laughs> a new study out says that COVID may cause penile shrinkage. What you failed to mention, he hasn't shrunk. He's just gotten harder to spot past that new COVID gut you put on during lockdown. Ah. <laughs> That's true, actually. <laughs> hey! A doctor in India named Miss Pragya Thakur. <laughs> <laughs> Close. No, I nailed it. Yeah. Pragya Thakur yeah. has urged the drinking of cow urine to ward off COVID. What you failed to mention, the name Pragya Thakur roughly translates in English to the woman no man dares to kiss. <laughs> oh, piss breath. Yes. Piss breath. Ooh, the crowd didn't like that. Oh, they did. Oh. Oh. The family. Bob Baffert, the legendary trainer. Whoa, that's a lot of booze. <laughs> I should probably play with these before I start. Bob Baffert, the legendary trainer, horse trainer, has been temporarily suspended from horse racing pending a full investigation into doping allegations. What you failed to mention, who gives a damn? Good point. Yeah. Well, there are a lot of people. Who uh, Chick has been talking about names of horse dope all week. Uh, yeah. What Chick failed to mention, some other names that goes by on the circuit, Boom Bap, Laverne and Shirley, Squiggy, <laughs> Lenny, Frank DeFazio. <laughs> oh, wait. I, I'm reading the Laverne and Shirley list. My bad. Uh, Sweet Baby Rays, yeah. uh, Mark McGuire, Ramalama Ding Dong, oh. and finally, the Razzle Dazzle. Oh. <laughs> A little steroids. Give me that razzle-dazzle. <laughs> and finally, on news that you all failed to mention, 
Flaming Hot Cheetos, uh, the man who invented Flaming Hot Cheetos, supposedly, is coming out with a book about his rise to glory within the company from janitor to executive. Frito-Lay, though, is now saying the man lied and, in fact, did not invent the hot, cheesy snack after all. What you all failed to mention, the name of his new book is called A Million Little Cheetos. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, it's very nice good obscure reference. reference. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Jeff Oske. Very and, nice. Uh, things we failed to mention. Well, no, we didn't fail to mention this next story. It's about, um, well, you got it, Christy. Which one do you want? Uh, the guy in his uh, <laughs> uh, DUI arrest. And oh, he... a Florida man, of course, arrested in a DUI, allegedly hid cocaine in his anus. According to Collier County Sheriff's deputy, the 48-year-old Marty Martinez was found sleeping behind the wheel of a pickup truck on the side of I-75. Oh. NBC2 reports. News. Where you, we, oh, but sorry to bother. Huh. News, we have it. I was, I was, I you, were you, you were lounging. You were laid back so six so feet from me. Let him do his job over there. He's relaxed. <laughs> Now, uh, Al, it's time for you to um, help me out with uh, the world of language. Tom, I got you, and I'm so glad we're talking about cars because that's going to lead us right into our first word of the day. Is Tom. it hoopty? I know that one. No. Oh, that's a <laughs> that's a good one. And actually, one of my old producers, her dog uh, was named Hoopty, which I thought was the coolest that's name. Awesome. That's a great that's name. Awesome now, can I refer to the car I drive as a Hoopty, Christy? No. No, no you don't. No. <laughs> Hardly. Hardly. No. Hardly. Especially that car. No. Yeah. I'm sorry. Mm -mm. If your car is closer to six figures, I don't think you can call it a hoopty. <laughs> yeah. is, 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 a, is a hoopty an older car? Yeah. yeah. So you don't know what a hoopty is, Tom. Well, every, every, he just <laughs> he heard the expression fly hoopty one time, and he hasn't stopped yeah. since. That they, and they my fly? man 50 grand. No, they don't fly, yeah. Tom. Oh. What are the yes. ones that are right at the top here? Like my man 50 That's grand, one. hoopty. Uh, 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 dookie, dookie rope. rope yeah. Dookie, dookie rope. rope. Dookie rope, yes. Riding dirty. Riding yeah. Yeah. Oh, I love riding dirty. <laughs> yeah. Riding dirty, yeah. No, you know what that means, Christy? Yes. What does it mean? <laughs> it means you're riding with an illegal gun in your car. No, no. Well, any kind of Anything illegal. Well, all right. For example. I think we know I how Christy rolls. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she went right to the gun. Damn. Uh, yeah, for example, I didn't have my wrench one time at the license branch, so I had a new plate. Yes. But it was on my front seat. Oh. So I was riding dirty. Yeah, boy, that's... Really Could have gotten pulled over. See. It's not even riding dusty. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, give me a new word. Al, help me here. I, I just like you were just telling that story. Hey, we're gonna get to it. It's just making me think about like what Tom's dirty talk would be. It'd be like, I'm gonna take you to a hotel. <laughs> it's gonna be not even a junior suite. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I'm not gonna check out. Man, we're just gonna walk out and just have it bill our card. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> no, Tom's fantasy is always the roadside motel. That's kind of seedy, but not. Oh yeah, that's, that's, a, that's a pretty good one. That's a good and one. And he also likes uh, the uh, a girl in an overhaul overalls, no shirt. Yeah. That's I don't blame one. you on that one. I'm yeah. with you. Really, awesome. your thoughts I'm about your father? Does anybody want a coffee? Uh, I'm going to get a smoke break real quick. Uh, I'm going to pick up smoking cigarettes again to get out of this conversation. Now, do, you, do you refer to your car as, as your hoopty? Uh, no, I think I'll just say like... Uh, no, his car's not a yeah, hoopty. Yeah, I'll say car. Like, you, want, you want to ride or something? I don't right. really talk about isn't, my car. Like. No, isn't whip... In yes. here more, more whip? so. Whip? Yeah, hop in yeah. the whip. I'm going to hop in my whip? Yeah. Hop in the whip, yeah. I'll pull the whip. Around. I had no idea that was true. I'll help Tom, me. Whip, Tom right? we did whip like two weeks ago <laughs> and you nailed it right off the bat. How did you do? T whip was one of those where you answered it so quickly. I was like, oh, that's a bad question. Well, maybe the and way then, you, how did you word it? Uh, I just asked what was a whip. And you nailed, you were like, you yeah. said a car within 10, like I don't know. not even 10 seconds. I don't remember. <laughs> Sorry. I've already forgotten to keep it. Tom is like Will Ferrell in old school when he had to do the debate and he just. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Move on. Yeah. Okay. Well, All right. What's my question? Tom, and, and, and by the way, if you guys want to see uh, more slang, I had, my daughter graduated eighth grade this past weekend. Shout out to baby Avery. And I asked her uh, slang terms from the 90s. Uh, it's on my Instagram live. It is hilarious. Oh, I cool. Had to, I, I had to explain to her what a pager was. <laughs> And her reaction of disgust and, like, also pity for our generation. <laughs> it, I mean, you have to see it. Just Al, uh, Al Jackson IG. But it's just like, she just is like, and then you had to find a payphone, you older man. 
<laughs> okay. Tom. Yes, sir. What is an L dog? <laughs> okay, now wait, hang on a second. Slow down. And I know an L dog. Slow down. Slow down. <laughs> I know. Somebody stop. It's I didn't think fast. we were speeding up. I know. Speaking of cars, I, I, I think I got. The, we were talking up. about cars. I know an Eldo is uh, uh, an El Dorado with a Landau roof. I don't think that has yeah. anything to Nothing do to with this. No. no. <laughs> an L dog is something else. And yes, don't, and don't say Pero. Um, <laughs> Thank you. Uh, <laughs> I don't. Uh, L dog. I uh, guess. Uh, oh, if you, I, oh, I know. Wait a minute. Who was the dude that uh, was always on? Uh, he was the, the bass player for Journey for a while. He called everybody dog. Jackson. Randy Jackson. Randy Jackson. Everybody, everybody, man or woman. That's right. El, an L dog is a Randy Jackson. Yeah, he nailed, <laughs> he nailed it. No, but I mean, he would say, hey, dog. Hispanic. Randy hey, dog. Jackson. So is an L dog, is that like you'd say, I'd say, L dog, let's get in my whip oh, and uh, go oh, smoke some jazz. You're get beat up. Say, oh, Tom. <laughs> like that, that was like when the knife goes all the way in and you're like, I had a good run. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it was good. I tried. Yeah. yeah. Tom, it's a, it's a type of car. It's old school. Oh, so it is. It is. It is it's not a, it, but it's not a Cadillac? No. Because the El Dorado was the famous. Hold on. It's, uh, okay. Does it start with an L? Oh. Yeah. Is yes, it like sir, a, it is, it, is it like a Lamborghini? <laughs> Instead of a Lambo, you got an L dog? Do you think enough people have Lamborghinis that we needed to invent slang for? It? <laughs> oh, okay. Um, well, we do because we call them Lambos, I guess. Um, it's not nah, true. Did, does it start with an L? He said that. Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, Lesaber's face. Lesaber. <laughs> A Buick Lesabre is the L dog. Is by, what you're yeah. saying. by the way, I'm just going to say, as a person that uh, remembers the world before marijuana was legal, any place that I went to make a purchase, there was 11 Buick Lesabres. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. That is the telltale they sell drugs at this apartment. Yeah. 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 Whenever I see a Buick Lesabre, I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm going to pay $75 for an eighth. Gee. <laughs> yeah. I see. That's too much money to spend for that. So, it, so but you would say if, if L dog is a vehicle so you would say hey, I'm gonna I'm gonna hop in my L dog yeah definitely I'm gonna okay. help him I'm gonna hop in my L dog you hop in your lack it's not a Lambo oh no. no. you're asking uh, the same question twice I know I'm trying to think I, I, well, you can you got this uh, cars that start with L <laughs> yeah I feel like jo Josh knows it Josh, Josh is sitting knows back it. like go a, ahead Josh like a, let me know I'm gonna guess it's also the name of a president yes yes sir. Tom think it through oh a Lincoln yes, oh, yes. L dog that seems disrespectful to Abraham Lincoln Call what? him L dog? Yeah. Yeah, he needs disrespect like a hole in the head, right? <laughs> <laughs> Funny, dude. Right? Yeah. Right? That's good. Chick sneaking around in the weeds. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <You're a> sniper. <laughs> All right. So uh, my L dog. Okay. That's common parlance, apparently. Yeah, <laughs> one of the famous uh the remix to uh Southern uh to uh, to Outcast Southern playlist uh was uh it starts with uh everybody's in their L dogs. Not Nothing but those lacks. What, what is a lack? <laughs> oh, obviously that's easy. That's a Cadillac. There you go. Yes, yeah. that's what they're talking okay. about. You got your mo right, you got your mojo back. Okay, well, uh, I, I, I gotta move on here. Um, uh, do they still talk about Electra? Electra. That, like a Buick Electra? Is that still Car Carmen? Oh, jeez. <laughs> Not Carmen. <laughs> Not Carmen. Is there any Never other mind. kind of Electra? <laughs> <laughs> Boy, she's hot. Al Jackson, you got you got any gigs coming up, Al? Uh, yeah, they'll all be on my Instagram soon because I got to write them all down. Uh, but I was going to tell everybody, make me a, a, a playlist on Spotify. You can make Al Jackson a playlist on your Spotify and listen to my jokey jokes. Oh, cool. And uh, new album's coming out very, very, very soon. So okay, and it's, I appreciate and, 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 all, all y'all support. One can find you, Al Jackson IG. God, I love that jacket. Okay. Yes, sir. Welcome back to the Bob and Tom Show. There's Ace Cosby over there. There's Chick and Josh. Hello. This is Tom speaking. There's Willie G. Christy Lee, of course, at the Navy Federal Credit Union News Desk. And Mr. Yep. Pat Godwin is through the glass. I see him on the big screen. Hello. He, of course, is in the Oxford Gold Performance Room. This morning we did the beautiful Oxford Gold in Oldie. Uh, get yourself a little bit of Oxford Gold, ladies and gentlemen. 855-710-GOLD. Now... Christy, have we covered everything? No, we haven't done today in history because one of my good uh, friends' birthdays today. We need to mention. Oh, who is it? And now for 
today. Well, we got I think it's not my birthday. Which one of Christie's good friends is a birthday. friend of the show, Tony Stewart, turns 50 today. Oh, how about that? Yeah. All right. Okay, right. Tony. Tony. Uh, Hunky Tony. Uh, Engaged to Leah Pruitt, the fabulous drag racer. That's very exciting. Wow. I don't know who that is. Really, really. You don't know who Leah Pruitt is? No, I don't. Oh, oh yeah. my God, you guys. The good news is she's used to incredibly great things happening in very short periods of time. <laughs> <laughs> kind of a drag. Chris, I know you can tell. Well, there went my friendship with Tony. Thanks. Yeah, I know more. <laughs> I know less about drag racing and more about RuPaul's Drag Race. That's oh, where okay. I'm at. Yeah. That is fair. Uh, not a real her, name. Uh, her name is uh, Donnie Iris. Uh, uh, Leah. Oh, yeah. Very there you nice. go. There you very go. Nice. So now let's talk about today in history, shall we? <laughs> okay. Levi Strauss and Jacob Davis received the patent for blue jeans. Well, how did Jacob Davis get forgotten by history? Now, why isn't it called the Levi Jacobs? Happened in well, 1873. Out. So, like, the ultimate cool thing would be a nice pair of Jakes? Nice pair of cut-off Jacobs. Yeah. Wow. Well, cut-off Jacobs sounds like something that happened at the Briss. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Jacob would be, that was, would be that a, was a Jewish funny. name. Not right. necessarily. Yes. Just, Very good. That, that was nicely Jacob. done. I just thought of that. Yeah. I, I, uh, <laughs> just, <laughs> you should do that more often. Well, oh, yeah, you're, exactly. You're very funny off the cuff. You are very yeah. funny. No, I'm sorry. Just, I just, I, no, I'm okay yourself. to be off the cuff. I, know, I, I have not read today's history. Well, Levi's. I have not read it yet today, and I was just, I'm just keep as, going. astonished Don't. that Mr. Davis got screwed like oh, that. That is weird. Yeah. Wonder what I mean, happened. You know, be like being on this show and no one knows who you are. Huh? huh? Josh. <laughs> That happens a lot. <laughs> what, are I, I'm not kidding. what do you do over there? Yeah. Yesterday you called him Jason. You don't uh, even know his name. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Uh, let's see. How about this one? Oh, we got some flying stuff. Ooh, one has a bad end. Flying out. stuff? Yeah, Charles Lindbergh takes off from New York for the first nonstop flight across the Atlantic in 1927. Oh. One of the foremost American Nazis? <laughs> oh, my God. Charles Lindbergh? Henry look Ford, too. Look there may have up. been some unfortunate. Henry Ford, too. Henry Ford, yeah. yeah. yeah I'll handle up. the history, okay? <laughs> Oh, jeez. Lindbergh. <laughs> Apparently. Didn't his kids get abducted or something? Uh, yes. Yeah, it was, uh, Jesus. Good pilot, I... bad at closing upstairs windows. I care. <laughs> <laughs> He's so mad at me and Jay. See, if Lindbergh had Simply Safe, none of that would have happened. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. That's right. The spirit of St. Louis, we could go that direction. Yeah. You ever mm -hmm. seen it? Yes, I have. Teeny There's, tiny. There's no windshield. Nope. There isn't. To land, he had to stick his head out the window like a Labrador retriever no, in a car. A lot of bugs true. in his teeth. When, yes. they, when they packaged it up to put it in the, the museum, they put a steel uh, over the windshield. False. It was a giant gas tank. No, he was almost blinded by wiper fluid. Uh, <laughs> fine. <laughs> See, it would hit the steel. Yeah, all right, okay. Now that you've but, been disrespectful there, how about being disrespectful about Amelia Earhart? Oh, she disappeared right. on this 1932. Day? In love with El Eleanor Roosevelt. We don't know it. Leaves Newfoundland to become the first woman to fly solo and nonstop across the she's Atlantic. Flying. She's amazing. She Fred Newton kept trying Women pilots, it. am I right? Hey. <laughs> so it's unbelievable. And Chick, I'm pretty sure she did spend some time in Austria and Germany Trust in the early no, 30s. Right. <laughs> There's Italian. I think that might have been the case. Ace, so for your benefit, in 1980, drummer Peter, this says drummer Peter Chris quit the band Kiss. Is that true? He's fired. That's what I thought. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then uh, on this date in 94, Bobcat Goldthwait uh, was charged with misdemeanors for setting a fire oh. on the couch in The Tonight Show. It's an unreasonable overreaction to a <laughs> solid comedy bit. <laughs> uh, time now to review uh, what we learned on today's show, yes, that's please. Exactly oh, wait. Right. Brought to you what? by... What? What? Oh, it's Cher's birthday today. I, this is one of my favorite Napa. things Chick does. Napa. If I could... If I could turn back time. <laughs> <laughs> Things we learned brought to you by Napa Auto Parts, no, whether it's no, next no, day no, delivery. No, 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 we, yeah, we did. I have to finish the birthdays. What? Cher, born Sherilyn Sarkeesian. Mm -hmm. Happy sure. birthday. And, of course, the co-founder of Red Bull. Josh, you got a pencil? Okay, yeah. Uh, Dietrich. Yes. <laughs> Last name, ready. Yeah. M-A-T. Yep. E. Yes. S C H I T Z. Easy. Oh, mate shits. Yeah. <laughs> sure. Yeah. And oddly enough, I, mate shits. the caffeine in that Red Bull. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> anyway, good morning. Time now for things we learned. Brought to you by Napa Auto no Parts. <laughs> no wonder the guy. Was <laughs> Did you hear Dietrich got married? Mate shits? Well, she sure does. <laughs> <laughs> when
whether it's next day delivery or getting involved in their local communities, we can't stop the feeling. Funny, we can't. Napa goes above and beyond to serve you because their motor never quits Sorry. and they love us. That's Napa know-how. <sighs> that poor guy. <laughs> I mean, no wonder he had yeah. time to develop a <laughs> develop. Red Bull, yeah. Oh, my God. Uh, can you imagine the first time he gets off a plane in the United States? Hey, buddy, come here. Yeah. <laughs> Driving those Red Bull cars is hard with that big can on top of your roof. Okay, let's see. Where was I? <laughs> oh, um. like your big can on my roof. <laughs> here we go. Hey, now. Hey, now. Hey, now. Remember this? Israel Kowalawaska yeah. Big cool. Amazing. Uh, 1959. Sadly, he's gone. Yeah, he, what is that piece of crap? Israel uh, Kamakawaioio, yeah. whatever his name is. Walked so in the lovely. studio at 3 a.m. That's one take. That okay. is, fam that is yeah. famously one take, 3 a.m. Okay. And um, he, everyone loves him. And, uh, they, I they, never they, heard of him. Oh, he had a big fight with his brother, Palestine. Uh, sure. Yeah, that was so That's the joke you're making. <laughs> We're doing that joke. Yeah. We're doing Gaza Remember, jokes. read the room. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> We're in the Gaza Strip Club. Oh, We're in the Gaza Strip I mean, really. Oh, God. Ten seconds. Uh, Ten all that seconds. is my fault, by the way. Yeah. Remember that. Uh, oh, we, we learned will. a lot of stuff on today's show. We You're sure welcome. <laughs> Tall hair suit. Tall, Tall hair, hair suit. suit. Go ahead, do the last Chewbacca thing. Thank you. Yeah. This is the Bob and Tom Show. Just. Watch the entire show live or on demand at bobandtom.com. Or listen live with the Bob and Tom app. And be sure to tune in next time for more Bob and Tom Tonight.